Many frogs can swim in deep water and will even go out into the open ocean. Some species of frogs use their webbed feet to propel themselves through the water while others simply float and drift with currents. There are many other species however that cannot swim at all and just avoid water under normal circumstances, but there are still some that live an entirely aquatic lifestyle. All of these types of frogs spend most of their lives in the water, but they come to land in order to mate and lay eggs. Some frog species can also leave the water for short periods of time during mating season in order to help protect their eggs, which are laid on land at that point. This is part of the reason that frogs are normally not found in open water where they cannot touch bottom, but this is a very rare occurrence. Actually, frogs live on land and in freshwater rivers and ponds, they do however sometimes venture into marshes and other areas with standing water oceans, etc. But usually only to feed or breed. Some species of frog are even aquatic and live their lives in the water. How fast can frogs swim? Frogs can swim at up to 2 feet per second, which is relatively slow compared to the speeds that they are capable of traveling on land. Furthermore, frogs are not particularly graceful swimmers either. Frogs swim by alternately moving their back legs which propel them through the water. When frogs need to make a sudden movement, they use their front legs to push off. A frog's speed through the water is directly related to the size of its body. Smaller frogs tend to move more quickly than larger ones. Can frogs swim in saltwater? By Amelia Hasten No, saltwater is toxic to frogs. Frogs have thin skin through which they absorb water and other substances that are necessary for life. If there is too much salt in the mixture then the frog will not be able to get enough of this vital liquid and will die. This holds true even if the frog is kept in a saltwater mixture for a small amount of time. The chemical composition of fresh water and saltwater are quite different. The main component of both is water but there are other elements in either mixture that will cause the frog to die if it is exposed to too much of it. Fresh water has a balance of sodium, Na, chloride, Cl, and hydroxide ions, O, while saltwater has an excess of sodium, Na. Can frogs swim chlorine water? If the chlorine is in a pool, no. Chlorine will kill a frog quickly if it enters a frog's lungs. This will happen because frogs breathe through their skin and the chlorine is bad for their skin. If it is in drinking water, like your town puts chlorine in the tap water to make it safe, then I'm not sure. If you taste the water, it may have a slightly bitter taste. One thing to watch out for are frog ponds that are used as breeding ponds by mosquito fish or other predators who eat frog eggs and tadpoles. Be sure your pond is not one of these. Frogs can do anything any other vertebrate can do, provided they have the physical capabilities. So, if a frog has gills instead of lungs, it will drown in chlorine water because it cannot breathe chlorine. Frogs cannot live in salt water either because their cells burst from osmotic pressure. They need fresh water. If you must keep frogs in chlorinated water, there are products available that remove chlorine from the water. Can tree frogs swim? It is a common question asked by people who have frogs in captivity. If they escape, can they swim or dive? With tree frogs being semi-aquatic, the answer is yes, though not for long periods of time. Each species of frog has different capabilities and tolerances but all are more than capable of swimming short distances to either escape a threat or find a new place to call home. During rain, frogs can become quite active as they look for areas to escape the water. Many people have found their frogs climbing up walls and across ceilings during this time. This is not accidental though it might appear so initially. It's been documented that many species of frogs seek out open areas to absorb heat during rainfall. A frog might also swim or dive if it falls into the water accidentally. However, few frogs can survive long underwater unless they are very adept at swimming and diving.